Welcome! In front of me I have Motorola Moto 100 and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with your iPhone via the Moto Watch application. Once the devices are paired together, we can continue. And now we need to make sure that the required permissions are allowed for the Moto Watch application and your iPhone to send the notifications to your watch. So let's open the settings on our iPhone. In settings, find the Bluetooth option and tap on it. And here in the Bluetooth menu, you should see the list of my devices. And on this list, you should see Moto Watch 100. Tap on the info icon next to it. Make sure that the share system notifications option is enabled. Once it is, go back to the main page of settings, scroll down and find the uh, Moto Watch application on the list of applications. Once you find it, tap on it. And here you make sure that the, that the Bluetooth option is enabled. You can also tap on notifications and enable allow notifications, but this uh, option is uh, not required, it's optional. And once you're done, you can close these settings, open the Moto Watch application on your iPhone that is paired with your watch. Now tap on the profile icon right here, tap on Moto Watch 100, and find the Reminders and Alerts option, tap on it, and here we have App Alerts and Calls. First let's tap on App Alerts. And right here we can enable and disable the alerts for the applications for basically so we can tap on the switch to enable or disable the alerts and once you enable them you can tap on manage apps and here you can um, turn on and off the notifications for specific apps and how it works is basically if you enable the notification for the app and you receive the notification from that app on your iphone that notification will be forwarded to your watch. But if you disable the notifications for it, uh, you will receive that notification on your iPhone, but it won't be forwarded to your watch. So that's how it works. Okay, so find the apps on the list right here. Oh, my bad. Let's go back here. Enable the notifications for the apps you like. If you don't see the application you want to use on this list right here, make sure to enable the others option. Once this option is enabled, it will enable the uh, notifications for all the applications on your iPhone that are not on this list, basically. Okay, and once you're done, you can go back, tap on calls, and here we can enable or disable the notifications for calls. So if somebody calls you on your iPhone, the watch will vibrate and it will display the contact information. And to disable or enable it, tap on the switch next to incoming call alerts. Okay, and once you're done, you can close the application. At this point, you should be able to receive the notifications on your watch. So let me check if I'm logged in on Discord right here on iPhone. I am. Now I'm gonna send myself a message on Discord. Now as you can see, we got it on our iPhone and also on our watch. If you miss the notifications on your watch, you can always wake up the screen on it and then swipe upwards on the screen to open the notifications menu. You can tap on the notification to read it. Um, to clear them, I believe you can swipe on them left or right. And that's about it. Okay, and that's how you enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.